my gourmet cooks and welcome back to another video with glamorous gems gourmet recipes what's on the menu today is squash spaghetti <laughs> y'all i have tried saying this like three million times okay what's on the menu today is spaghetti squash um and i'm just gonna serve a meat sauce on top of that so we're gonna go ahead and jump into the ingredients. So for this, I'm using um, ground turkey, but you can use your choice of meat. You'll need spaghetti sauce, garlic onion powder, minced garlic onion, seasoned salt, Parmesan cheese, red cayenne pepper. You can also substitute that for the crushed red pepper, black pepper, and an onion. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get cooking. So I started by, of course, rinsing my spaghetti squash, and then you wanna go ahead and cut down the middle um, and just kind of cut it in half. Um, but I struggled with this, so I'm gonna go ahead and leverage my husband just to cut it um, for me because it was very hard to do. Um, so once he cuts it right down the middle, I'm then gonna go ahead and um, just try to cut off the, um, stem that's on the end of it and then I'm going to scrape out all of the seeds and discard the seeds so um, you'll just see me doing that. I'm gonna go ahead and brown my meat here and add my seasonings and for all of the measurements and seasonings used in the video definitely check out my description box below I will have everything listed for you there once I have my meat seasoned I'm gonna go ahead and dice up an onion um, so you'll see me doing that and then um, I'm gonna go ahead and add my tomato sauce and my diced onion um, in the saucepan um, with my meat and um, I'm also going to add in a teaspoon of minced garlic. Mix everything around and you're going to let this simmer on a medium to low setting for about 20 minutes. I'm going to take my cooking spray and I'm going to go ahead and spray the bottom of my pan. And then I'm going to take some olive oil and I'm going to drizzle that um, in the inside of my squash just to give it a nice um, moisture to it. And I'm gonna put it face down on the pan. Um, and I'll repeat that with the other half that I have. And you wanna go ahead and bake this in the oven for 40 minutes at 350. My squash is now out of the oven. I did set a timer at 40 minutes at 350 for um, it to bake. Um, one easy way to know if it's complete is by taking a butter knife or a fork and just sticking it in the squash to see if it is fork or knife tender. Once it is, then you just let it sit for about 10 minutes before you start to fill it with everything. So um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get this baby filled up. So I have my squash on my plate and I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of salt and black pepper. I'm just on the inside to give it a little bit of a flavor. Once I've done that, I'm gonna go ahead and take my meat sauce and I'm going to pour my meat sauce in the inner well that we've made um, of the squash. And um, then I'm gonna go ahead and top it with some cheese. Whatever cheese you prefer, you can go ahead and do that. Your meat sauce should still be pretty hot because it's been simmering on the stove. So the cheese should go ahead and melt, but you could always you know, microwave it or put it in the oven if you choose to. And then I'm gonna garnish it with some grated Parmesan cheese and oregano. So this is my finished and completed squash spaghetti or spaghetti squash with meat sauce. Um, I love how it turned out. Um, as you can tell, you see the grated Parmesan cheese with your cheese and oregano that I have garnished on top. That meat sauce is in there and it's just so nicely formed. Um, now, 
it kind of can sink down a little bit. So I had to be very delicate with how I placed it on my plate, but nonetheless, um, it still turned out really good. Also, if you all are liking videos like this, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Um, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell. That way you're notified every time I upload a video on my channel. Um, and you can just stay up to date with all of my recipes that I have. So now what I'm going to do is take my fork and I'm going to show y'all how um, I eat this. So I'm just raking my fork with the squash. And as you do that, you will see that it kind of turns into little spaghetti. So hence spaghetti squash. Um, and I just went ahead and raked my finger and kind of mixed it in with the meat sauce. And I'm going to go ahead and just eat it just like that. So yeah, very healthy, a great alternative for pasta. And I know that you all will enjoy this. So yeah, until next time, I'll see you gems in the next video. Bye.